All right, guys, so for this assignment, what I want you to do is I want you to do just like where Aristothenes did, where he went back and he built a map of where he had been. You're going to do the same thing, or what he knew about. It. You're going to do the same thing. Now, an example of this, if you've never been to Rhode Island, you won't include Rhode Island into your map. Uh, if you've never left Keensburg, then your map should be pretty much just of Keensburg, okay? Uh, for this, some of the materials, you'll have some construction paper, uh, white printer paper, you can use that as well. Colored pencils, ruler tape, and a protractor. If there's anything else you want to use, that's fine. Just check with me first, okay? Let me show you a couple examples of what I'm looking for here. Okay, here's an example of what a student of mine had done. Now, while she's been to all these states, you can't tell me that she's been to every square inch of Kansas, right? Or she's been to every square inch of New Mexico or California. All we're going to do is we're going to include what you've actually seen. So if you've only been to, say, Los Angeles, then you would include just Los Angeles. Okay, so even at that, we're not much. Now, if you drove through a state, you can only drive, draw the roads that you've seen. Okay, so it's very difficult to write about something or draw on your map something that's never been there. Okay, but I do like this map because it's creative. Um, she's got like the Z's for Kansas because it's boring and flat. Iowa's got some corn there. Um, you know, the city there with the airplanes because she flew in there. You get the idea. Here's another example. Drew the whole United States, but this really wasn't necessary, right? How would she know that that's where that ended? So you just and just a couple of states here. Uh, so and including the whole states, you mean you've been there a square inch? Doubtful. So you're not going to do that. You're going to be putting what you saw. If you need to go back to the lecture I had video taped, the very first one, it was part one, had a picture of Eratosthenes' nap map of what he knew about of the modern world. That's exactly what you're going to do for this one. Remember, you're looking for extra points here, extra ways to do that. If you had to add grid squares, uh, you know, latitude and longitude onto your map, which these don't have, that's all bonus stuff for you. All right, guys, good luck. See how this works out for you.